A prisoner swap was never part of the nuclear deal. But Secretary of State John Kerry said here it helped speed things up. Iran has undertaken significant steps that many, and I do mean many, people doubted would ever come to pass. The international nuclear watchdog, the IAEA, announced it was satisfied that Iran had taken those steps to disable its nuclear program. After three decades of economic isolation, the deal means Iran is now allowed to sell oil on the open market. The country can reconnect with the international banking system and begin to recoup roughly $100 billion in frozen assets around the globe. Today, Iranian President Hassan Rouhani called the deal a golden page in Iran's history. But political battles remain over the uneasy relationship between two countries that have been sworn adversaries for decades. The deal includes a snapback mechanism, meaning sanctions can be quickly reimposed if Iran fails to comply. The most sanctioned country in the world has now become the most closely watched. For Sunday morning, I'm Charlie Daggett in Vienna.